Good evening, everyone. So I'm here today to say I cut all my hair off today. I relieved my head of her hair. The irony is I was working so hard to let it grow back in that I was diagnosed with breast cancer. So I decided to let my hair on top of my head match my eyebrows. <laughs> They're going to go. I wanted it all to grow in, but I guess I'll go ahead on and get these trimmed up and um, looking a little bit more decent. But the funny thing is, I thought that I was going to look really funny. I thought my head was full of lumps and bumps, but it actually looks good. It's an interesting little thing here to not have any hair. I figured that... um. If I believed myself of it before the radiation did, I would feel a lot better. My grandson said, well, why don't you <laughs> become Baldina after the radiation treatments, Mr. Jokester? Always got some joke. But my youngest son said to me, Mom, your head looks good. <laughs> that, was a, that was a compliment for me. And of course, my youngest daughter was like, oh, Mommy, that really looks nice. And then my oldest daughter said, I would, maybe I'll cut mine too <laughs> in honor of you, which would be so nice. But, yep, I cut my hair off today. And um, I had wrote something. I had written something about it. It just kept going through my mind. But I have this little book that I found about two months ago. And it's called Just Keep Growing. A little devotional and encouragement thing to um, create. So that's why I had purchased it through the Corona thing, the COVID-19. And I didn't put much in it, but it has little sections. And the first section is live life in full bloom. And the first thing I had written was today... 62120. I choose to live my life like I and it is golden. No bad days and no drama, only peace, love, joy, faith, and positivity. So that was almost two months ago, right after I was diagnosed with breast cancer. And then this other section says, Let go and grow. So what I was, um, what kept running through my mind was I decided to let it go. So I wrote this. I decided to let it go before it relieved itself of me. So I let go. I cut all of my hair off today in anticipation of her new growth and her loss. Here I am in a plastic bag ready for the scrapbook journey. And it's in there that she should lie to tell her silent story. I cut all of my hair off today in anticipation of her new growth. Beauty is as beauty glows and the boldness shine like a starlight glows in the beauty of the sky. So, <laughs> I cut all my hair off today. <laughs> and I kind of like it. But uh, I would like, for, like to see how it come, when it comes back in what it's going to do. It's kind of hot, so I'm sweating a lot right now. It's going to be a little annoying, but I cut all my hair off.